Here we are with the overview section. Here comes the killer part, overview. This is where you can briefly describe what you can do for your client. This is where you market yourself as a complete package and cover items that may not fit in other profile sections. Don't forget to write all the key skills that you can capable of to serve to the client. Write some attention grabbing sentences on your overview. You can give clients a better feel for your professional background, range of services, personality and work preferences while also giving them a better feel for who you are as a person. Always, always, always remember to highlight how your skills and accomplishments can help the client reach their business goals. After all, you have to prove your value to them. Take advantage of the space to address common problems and concerns your prospective clients may have. Are they having a hard time writing blog posts? Are they overwhelmed with all the marketing tasks? Is their inbox so full that they can't even find the compose button? Tell them how your services can help the client to achieve their goals. Show how aware you are of issues business owners face and that you are here to help. This also positions you as a reliable professional. Mention any credential or achievement that reflects positively on you graduating from a prestigious university, working for or with a Fortune 500 company, achieving something noteworthy in your field, if you wrote an article for a national publication, make sure to mention that as a part of your description. If a website you designed gets millions of hits, make sure you bring that to the forefront. As jobs become competitive, each and every little plug for your skill set can make a huge difference. Finally, proofread your overview to ensure that there are no spelling or grammar mistakes. I am saying again, proofread your overview to ensure that there are no spelling or grammar mistakes because nothing will make a client drop you fast like poor grammar. So here are some tips I can give you. Start with the most important information first because only the first two or three sentences of your overview are visible in search results. At the end of your overview, you can include soft skill related to your area of expertise, such as reliable, good communication skills, first learner, attention to details, etc. When creating your overview, have these things in mind. type of work you want to do and the industry you want to work in. Years of experience you hold. Your proficiency with systems and industry relevant software. Accomplishments you are proud of. 
languages you speak and are proficient working in. Your clients aren't interested in your hobbies or your life goals, so keep those personal details to a minimum. Don't go straight into bullet points about your accomplishments. Start with at least a one paragraph summary of you, your talents and your overall work philosophy before you start listing things. Summarize yourself as if it was the only thing potential clients could read about you. So yes, let's see some examples of overview. Here I am with my profile and this is the overview as you can see. Hello and welcome. Let's press this button. And yes, when you listing out overview, here are some points. Upwork listed out, use this space to show clients you have the skills and experience they are looking for. Describe your strengths and skills. Highlight projects, accomplishments and education. Keep it short and make sure it is error free. Yes, error free. So there should be no error. You understand that? There should be no error. Okay, let's see my overview. At first point, I am here with my overview. Hello and welcome my dear valued clients. How are you doing? I really appreciate your time for looking at my profile. I am guaranteeing you that I will give your time a value by providing my quality work that you deserve, you will see for sure. Well, are you looking for the best candidate here at Upwork for your transcribing, writing and translation project? Just to let you know, I, I am providing transcribing, writing and translation service here at Upwork professionally. So that's why I am making my overview and asking the client that are you looking for the best candidate here at Upwork for your transcribing, writing and translation project. So yes, I think I am one of the top most transcriber, writer and translator here at Upwork. At least I believe that and I had the confidence. So yes, let's proceed. So I am saying why not try me? Why I think I am the best candidate? Please explore me more. Here is my facts here. I have been working as a transcriber, writer and translator for 7 years. I am a top rated transcriber, writer, translator in this Upwork platform. I have worked with MIT, Stanford. Vanderbilt, Brighton, Swansea, Case Western Reserve University, University of Pisa, University of San Francisco, Cambridge University, Queen's University, Harriet Watt University. A lot of universities are there to list out. And here is LinkedIn, Verizon, QIQ Research. American Apparel and many many other organizations. I am yet to list out a lot of other organizations. I have worked with a lot of clients around the globe. Some of them are. So here are the clients, clients name and from where the client is from. Even Lieberman is from MIT. Robert Cleave is from the Chicago School of Professional Psychology. So here are th some PhD students I have worked with and they are from University of London, 
here is Farah Sheikh, Omar Salha, Salima F. Barney, Michael Goldberg. He is a professor of Case Western Reserve University. So yes, a lot of uh, Mark Graham, University of Oxford, Oxford Internet Institute. He is a professor there, Joshua Ong from Stanford University. So Eddie Francourt, Harriet Watt University. So a lot of universities as you can see and uh, I mostly work with university professors and PhD students as the need transcribing service most and and here is Lutz Finger, a uh, director at LinkedIn and yeah a lot of other companies as you can see with the person name uh, I have listed out around let's see so around 67 clients I have listed out there are more clients to go on and if I got some time I will list out for sure so here I'm saying I hope I have all the experience needed for your project I am looking forward to working with you on your project thanks for visiting me have a great day and stay safe side so this is my overview here as you can see I have shown all of the overview The whole overview written by me and this is the overview from me so this is the overview for my profile as you can see okay and let's see some other free freelancers profile let's see John's profile here I am an experienced freelance writer from the UK now based in China I have written hundreds of articles on a number of freelance writing websites and I currently write blogs on Chinese culture, history and travel. I have a varied experience in writing articles on topics such as how to travel, history, education, sport, cooking and recreation. I look forward to hearing from you and writing quality articles for your publication. So this is John's overview and seems like he is a writer from UK and he is now based in China. Let's see another person's profile. So let's see John WH's profile. The freelancer is from Portland, United States. Here is his profile. John the photographer. So, so this is his overview. Let's see what he listed out on his overview. As a painter, photographer with 35 years of experience, 22 years working on Mac with Photoshop, InDesign page maker and illustrator doing digital for web and print. I have worked with literally hundreds of clients on thousands of different projects. No kidding. Everything from 1000 page books to billboards to business cards and now websites. I have done all types of photography, typesetting, design and lots of image editing i am driven by quality and powered by experience if i can't do the job i won't waste your time so this is john's overview as you can see let's see another person's profile russell here russell john s and this freelancer is from philippines here is russell's Overview Over 13 years of progressive experience in the BPU and shared services environment and 10 years experience in managing teams. 
Lines of business handled include telecommunications, healthcare, directory assistance, help desk, procurement, and IT. Managed boys, back office, technical support, and customer service programs. ITIL Six Sigma Green Belt, Lean, Kaizen, and COPC trained. So seems like this freelancer has a lot of experience as a project manager as you can see as you can see he is an experienced project manager so vast amount of experience as you can see let's see justin's profile and this is Justin's overview. We are a group of professional insurance consultants with many years in the industry. We specialize in both home and auto insurance and love to help potential clients make well-informed decisions. We offer detailed and simple explanations of all endorsements and policy wordings to help you understand exactly what your provider is offering on either an existing policy or even an insurance quote. We will also try to identify any possible gaps in coverage that can leave you vulnerable in the event of a claim. So Justin is from Canada and he is experienced as an insurance advisor and consultant. Let's see Natalia's profile. She is from Canada, English, French, Russian translator and Russian transcriptionist. She can do French, English, Russian. So a lot of skills Natalia has. Teaching and communication skills, translating and organization skills and, and her personal qualities Natalia listed out here. Helpful responsible, attentive to detail, adaptable, fair, reliable, optimistic. So here is Natalia's profile overview. You can see already. Let's see another person's profile, Jason I from Canada. Jason is a data and analysis specialist. So he is a data analyst and here is his overview written here. So yes, that's all for this lecture and I look forward to seeing you in our future lectures. Thanks.